Hi folks, this is Peach Mario and in the last three videos I did show you how you can uh, install plugins, how you can uninstall plugins and manually install single plugins from editions and in this video I will show you some tips and tricks with uh, plugin configuration tillers. For example, Zek um, creates, uh, created a plugin library which contains uh, a tiddler uh, which uh, is a link uh, to the plugin library which then can be activated with the default uh, core mechanism how to install plugins from plugin libraries. Yeah? So if I, I'm here at tillwiki.com, if I go to the control panel, plugins, get more plugins, usually I only get this tab here. Yeah? Um, but if I import this tiddler from SEC, yeah, if I drag and drop it here and import it, then I get a new tab here, yeah, so SEC plugins. And yeah, we have it, so there are different plugins and I see uh, he also hosts the Relink plugin which works with the Streams library. Yeah? Um, and now you have uh, access to all the plugins. Uh, from SEC MTS. Uh, so this is from SEC MTS GitHub IO um, SQPL plugin library. Um, there is a plugin library. This one, then there is some uh, configuration information from Kukma, which also has some nice plugins which I import. Then this is my own configuration from my plugins, which I can import. Then there is uh, the Relink plugin. Um, provides a link with the plugin, but, but the plugin itself contains uh, a configuration tiddler. Yeah? And uh, I save it, save, and reload the whole thing. And now if I say open the control panel, plugins, and get more plugins, then we have all the tabs. So there is the official plugin library, uh, where we can import plugins. Then there is Kukma's plugin library, which contains 22 plugins. Yeah. Then there is my own plugin library, which contains 27 plugins. There is Sex plugin library, uh, which contains 10 plugins, and also he hosts the um, Relink plugin again. And there is the Relink plugin library, uh, which only contains Relink and two additional um, libraries which uh, allow you to relink uh, markdown uh, texts and relink titles. Yeah. Um, yeah, that's basically it. Yeah, There are some configuration titles which you can import. Uh, then there is a cool thing uh, with TiddlyWiki in general. If I open the system titles, there are the configurations, config editions. Yeah, this one. Um, these configuration tillers contain the information how to deal with uh, external libraries, and there is a text text plugin library. If I open this, then I can um, directly access those plugins, or I can drag and drop this uh, tag list um, to the bookmarks bar. Yeah? So there are some bookmarks, and if I drag and drop it here, yeah, then I say edit. Edit bookmark, uh, Tiliwiki plugin, or well, let's say Tiliwiki libraries. Okay, and now if I go to Tiliwiki.com again and I say reload and I drag and drop this uh, element, then I have all the configurations which I have saved and I say import, and now I do have these configurations, now they are part of um, the default configuration, uh, but no plugins are imported. So it's just the configuration tiddlers, um, how to access those third-party plugins. Yeah? So uh, you have access to SegMTS uh, plugin library, uh, Kukma, which is Mohammed, these are mine, yeah, the plugin libraries. There is the Relink plugin library, which is very, very powerful if you need to rename tillers. Uh, there may be some others, but I don't know them. Yeah? So please let me know uh, the information 
and as you can see the configuration or the structure how this information is presented is a little bit different uh, for every developer so yeah maybe we can take care of this and discuss it and make it a little bit more uh, concise for the users yeah but as I showed you if you drop it to this um, toolbar bar in the browser you can easily install it uh, in every uh, TeleWiki that you want uh, to use yeah that's basically it. a little bit of tips and tricks with uh, the TeleWiki uh, toolbar configuration tillers have fun <laughs>